legend of the mirror pond. It describes a spell I can use to send them back where they came from. That's perfect. Let's go. But there's a catch. If I can't figure out which one's the real Pinky, I might send her back by mistake. Well, we'll just have to figure out who the real one is then. Shouldn't be too hard. Oh. Does any pony here know how we can tell the real Pinkie Pie from all the rest of them? Uh, I don't know. Twilight, I have to talk to you. I need your help. Excuse me, whoever you are. But I'm not talking to any of you Pinkies unless you're the real Pinkie. Well, but, but I am the real Pinkie. No, you're not. I'm the real Pinkie. I'm the real Pinkie. No, I'm the real Pinkie. I'm the real Pinkie. No, I'm the real Pinkie. I'm the real Pinkie. No, I'm the real Pinkie. Are we supposed to tell which is the real Pinky? I have no idea. Me either. Oh, we've all got the same adorable tails. We've all got the same adorable mates. We've all got the same adorable hugs. Which one of us is the real Pinky? Uh, I haven't the slightest clue. And if I can't tell us apart, who can? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that one's the real Pinkie. Please, the real Pinkie Pie never sat that long in one place her whole life. I'm gonna go ask. Of course she's gonna say she's the real Pinkie. They all do. You're wasting your time. So let me guess. You're the real Pinkie Pie. Heck if I know. Could be any one of us if you ask me. And if I said I was the real Pinkie, you wouldn't even believe me anyway. So just leave me alone. I've got some important poke in the ground with my hoof to do. Oh, Spike, how are we gonna do this? I can't risk sending the real Pinky back into the pond. I miss the real Pinky. <sighs> I bet she misses you too. Bet she'd do just about anything to get to be with her friends again. Hey! Hey! What if you gave them a test? Pick something really hard for a Pinky to do. Something not fun at all. Any Pinky that can do it goes back into the pond. But whoever wants to stay the most, that must be the real Pinky. You know? It's not a bad idea. This is great! If I pass, I get to be with my friends again! <gasps> but what if I don't pass? Oh, what if I'm not the real Pinkie Pie? No! Stupid magic mirror water! This is all your fault! And mine. Hey, Twilight! I've been looking all over for you, ponies. What are you all doing here? Fluttershy spoke with the woodland critters, and they've agreed to take us into their home till the pinky storm dies down. You guys, we're gonna fix this, and I know exactly how. Are we gonna lose our real Pinkie Pie? I don't think so. Now come along. I've already got Applejack and her family rounding up all the Pinkies. wondering why I've gathered you all here today. For fun? No, just the opposite, actually. Wait up! I got one more! Found this one poking at the ground with her hoof, drawing frowny faces. Have her come sit with the others. Pinkies, you've been brought here to take a test. Aww. Don't worry, it's a simple test. About as simple as they come. And whoever passes gets to stay. <laughs> Curtain, please. The test, we'll be watching paint dry. <laughs> On your mark, get set, go! Oh, this is so exciting! Okay, maybe not that exciting. Watch me bounce 
touch the ceiling. Is that, is that a frog cross with an orange? Cool, where? Look what I can do with my hooves. Away now. I passed? You passed. You're the only Pinky who kept staring at the wall. I had to. I just had to. I couldn't leave my friends. I just couldn't. But I guess sometimes I will have to choose between them. Knew you'd be up to the challenge. I'm me. I'm me. I'm me. Or am I? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I am. Dear Princess Celestia, it's great to have fun, but it's even greater to have great friends. And having lots of friends means that you sometimes have to make choices as to whom you'll spend your time with. But that's okay, because good friends will always give you lots of opportunities to have fun. So even if you're missing out, it's never for long. Respectfully yours, Pinkie Pie. Hi, Pinkie Pie. We were thinking we should go out and celebrate. You up for some wheelbarrow races? Or I could take every pony on a cloud ride. I could throw a party with punch and zesty cucumber sandwiches. Ooh. You want to know exactly what I feel like doing right now? <sighs> that looks like fun. <laughs> <laughs> Pie, you're more nervous than Rainbow Dash. I'm not nervous at all. When I get into the Wonderbolt Academy... If you get in! If you get in! Don't jinx it! I'm telling you, it's in the bag! Don't jinx it! She is the best flower in Ponyville. In Ponyville? I'm probably the best flyer in all of Equestria. I wouldn't be surprised if they just went ahead and made me a Wonderbolt on the first day. Got a letter here for Rainbow Dash. I didn't get in. <laughs> gotcha! <laughs> you guys are so gullible. Like, I wasn't gonna get in. I'm just so happy for you! Uh, uh thanks. Pinkie Pie, I kinda need to get going. Okay, I'm done. Sooner I get there, the sooner I get to show my stuff. See you guys in a week. Good luck. Won't need it. Don't forget to Do you think she heard me? My little pony, my little pony. Faithful and strong, sharing kindness. It's an easy feat, and magic makes it all complete. You have mine. Do you know you are my very best friends?
think you're Wonderbolt material, don't you? Yes, ma'am! Think you got what it takes to be an elite flyer? Yes, yes ma'am! Well then, let me be the first to tell you. You don't! If you had what it took to be an elite flyer, you'd already be a Wonderbolt. You still think you're something special? No, ma'am. You think you're hot stuff? You look like you're the worst flyer in the whole academy. You'd probably quit after the first day. No, ma'am. I'd never quit, ma'am. Ha. What about you? Bet you couldn't fly past the first flagpole without getting winded. Try me, ma'am. What's that? Let me show you what I've got, ma'am. Oh, you want a chance to prove yourself, huh? Yes, ma'am. Well then, now's your chance. Give me 500 laps, all of you! Uh, now! For a couple of newbies. Name's Lightning Dust. Rainbow Dash. Wanna grab some grub in the mess hall? Definitely. Pinkie Pie, Rainbow Dash hasn't even been gone 24 hours yet. Give her a chance to settle in first. Why don't we just go see what Twilight's up to? I hear Princess Celestia's got her working on some new spells. New spells, huh? Okay. Wait, if I'm not here when Rainbow Dash's letter arrives, I won't be able to read it right away. And if I don't read it right away, I won't be able to write her back right away. And if I don't write her back right away, she might think I didn't get her letter, and then she might worry it got lost, and if she's worried about her letter, she'll be distracted. And if she's distracted, then she won't do well at the Academy. And if she doesn't do well at the Academy, then she'll get kicked out. And if she gets kicked out, we'll never let her be a letter ball. And if she doesn't get to be a letter ball, all her dreams will be crushed! And it'll be all my fault! So, in other words, you're sticking by the mailbox. Yep. Suit yourself. The Wonderbolts are the fastest, best precision flyers in the world. And spin outs can still happen. And when they do, a Wonderbolt must be able to recover quickly. Don't be scared, little friends. Twilight is wonderful with magic. Anything happens to them, Twilight, so help me. Aw, uh, don't worry, Fluttershy. Twilight's magic has gotten a lot better since she accidentally crushed me and Applejack with a giant snowball. Of course she's good with magic. Twilight's great with magic. I guess I just don't want my little friends to be scared. Oh, oh look how scared they are. <laughs> I promise, Fluttershy, nothing bad will happen to them. I know. Maybe we can practice again later, if Fluttershy says it's all right. Your magic has really improved since we came to Ponyville Twilight. Princess Celestia's gonna love it. Thanks, Spike. I have to be at my best when she arrives with the delegates from Saddle Arabia. I can't believe she's trusting me with the entertainment. Twilight, come quick, it's an emergency! What's she doing here? You call that 
great and powerful? gotten better since I was here last. And I'm going to prove it. Me and you, a magic duel. Winner stays. Loser leaves Ponyville forever. Forget it. I'd never make a deal like that. <laughs> Your choice. <laughs> Trixie, put him down. Why are you doing this? Why? Because you humiliated me! After you showed me up with that Ursa Minor, I became a laughing stock. Everywhere I went, I was laughed at and ostracized. I even had to take a job on a rock farm just to earn a living. A rock farm! Hey! You're lucky a rock farm would take the likes of you! <laughs> Now I want revenge, and I'll just keep casting spells till you agree. Well, what do you say? <laughs> All right, Trixie. Let's do it. Excellent. <laughs> If I lose, I won't set Hoof in Ponyville again. But if you lose, you're the one banished from this one-horse town. <gasps> Draw! <gasps> 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 pretty much every day since then. Apple Blue, how are them RSVPs coming along? Who's showing their muzzle at the reunion? Every pony. Every pony? Feathers on the goat. Are you sure? Well, I got RSVPs from Apples from Yonder Hill, Hollow Shades, Galloping Gorge, Old Mountains, Apples from Philadelphia, Tall Tale Tale, and all the Apples from Appaloosa. Uh. Oh, and how could I forget? Is coming. I get to see my favorite cousin. Think we're gonna need a bigger cider truck. My little pony, my little pony.
A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness. It's an easy feat. And magic makes it all complete. You have mine. Do you know you are my very best friends? <laughs> Looks like the family's grown tenfold since the last reunion. I'm gonna be busier than a worm in a rotten tomato trying to get everything ready. I could always help out. Me too. Yep. Oh, I sure would appreciate that. Granny's a little rustier in the giddy-up since the last time the apples all got together. You may be a tad old, Granny, but you're as feisty and full of spark as ever. Who are you calling old? Uh... I just meant, why don't you let me take over putting the reunion together this time round? Then all you need to worry about is enjoying yourself. Hmm. All right, youngin. You got yourself a deal. You are in charge. I won't let you down, Granny. You just tell me what the reunion needs, and I'll take care of the rest. I'll do better than tell you what the reunion will need. I'll show ya. We've been hosting these things to Sweet Apple Acres every hundred moons since we first planted roots here in Ponyville. Hey, who's that? That'd be your great great auntie Applesauce when she's just about your age. Now, she's go by another name, but every pony started calling her Applesauce after half her teeth fell out and she's making apple jam. Yeah, never did find them teeth in all those jars. Hey, let's go, Granny. Sure is. Apple family's been working on that same old quilt since our first reunion. I can do it. <laughs> oh, fangle, fangle! <laughs> <laughs> well, no pony told me you actually had to knot the end of the thread. <laughs> okay, so I'll need to get new quilting materials, fabric, needles, thread. You've really been working on the same quilt since the first reunion? Surely have. I don't think we're ever gonna finish that doggone thing. Hey, what's going on here? Well, you know us apples enjoy a good fritter. Hey, where did all the apple fritters go? The others are having better luck. A way to protect the Emperor. You know anything about it or what? I wish I could help you. Really. Come on! You gotta know something! But I don't have any information. Oh, um, excuse me. Oh, hello. Um, I was just wondering. <gasps> That's okay, um, you all look really busy. <laughs> Time to gather some intel. It just feels like something is missing. I know. It looks the same, but it doesn't feel the same. Because it isn't! <gasps> A spy! <laughs> Goggles. Ooh, night vision -y. And when you flip your mane, it simply must create a rainbow of color. Oh, wouldn't I look just magnificent? So sparkly. <laughs> Sorry, Twilight. These crystal ponies seem to have some kind of collective amnesia or something. Only thing I was able to get out of them was something about a library. <gasps> a library? Oh, why didn't you say so? Uh, thought I just did. I just... I don't even know what to... There are no words. Ahem. <clears throat> May I help you? Yes, we're looking for a book. We have plenty of those. 
You do. You really do. We're looking for a history book. Something that might tell us how the Empire might have protected itself from danger back in the day. Yes, of course. History, history. Ah, yes. Which is where, exactly? I... I can't seem to remember. I'm not sure I actually work here. Uh, we'll just take a look around. I'm sure we can find it on our own. Let me know if you find anything. I like her! This is a lost cause. No, 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 no. Yes! History of the Crystal Empire. I just hope it has the answers we need. A crystal fair. According to this book, it was established by their first queen and became their most important tradition. The fair was held every year to renew the spirit of love and unity in the Empire so they could protect it from harm. My friends and I could put it together. Everything we need to know is in the book. That sounds pretty promising. We'll get started right away. Come on, Spike. We've got a crystal fair to put together. <laughs> Princess Cadence needs our help. Her magic will not last forever. I think we can do it, but we need to work together. We have to get this right. Yes, we have to make them see. We can save the crystal ponies with their history. It says that they like jousting. They flew a flag of many hues. Make sweet to to make sure everything is in place. And then the festivities can begin. What's this thing for? The last page of the book mentioned a crystal heart as the fair centerpiece. So I used my magic to cut one out of a crystal block. Nice work, Twy. Think we're ready to get this fair up and running. Seeing all of this, I 
feel like I'm starting to remember. Remember things from before the king. Me too. <gasps> the crystal heart! Do you think they really have it? Of course we have it! Can't have a crystal fair without the crystal heart, right? Of course you can't. The whole purpose of the crystal fair is to lift the spirits of the crystal ponies so the light within them can power the crystal heart so that the empire can be protected. I do work at the library. What's that about powering the heart? I just can't believe you found it. King Sombra said he'd hidden it away where we would never see it again. I only hope it will still be as powerful after all these years. Mmm, <gasps> funnel cake. <laughs> Relic. The book didn't mention anything about the crystal ponies powering the heart. There was a page missing. How did I not notice? It's all right, Twilight. Twilight.